to my channel my name is Sherry Foss and I'm based in Nova Scotia in Canada on my YouTube channel I just share my personal experience about life here in Canada and life generally on my channel I also do videos about immigration to Canada so Canadian immigration from a study permit to work permit permanent residence storage business and school admission so I'm going to this where I work can help you with all of those okay in this video me and my children are going to Two places. One is called the Lekki Conservation Center, where the longest canopy walkway is, and then another fun place like an art gallery, like an art place. We will do some painting, some sea pan painting, some fun stuff. So come with us today in an, another of our episodes of our Lagos Living in Nigeria. And I have my girl with me. I have my girl. Are you ready? Yeah. And then I have my boy too. Yeah. Okay. Okay, are we ready? Yeah. Yeah. Ready to places. <laughs> and this is us at the gym section of the place we got while in Lagos while waiting for our ride. Meanwhile, am I the only one that find this strange exercising during a holiday? Like, I always get a place that has a pool, a gym, and all those uh, 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 facilities. Well, hardly would you find me in the gym during holiday. Like, I just think that. Uh, like I'm not, I'm here to enjoy. <laughs> the least on my mind is exercise. So if you see me on the exercise place, it's just for photo or for video. Honestly, I don't like. I I hardly exercise during a holiday. My son likes it, but nah, not me. Anyway, so that's that. Then our ride came, and then we set out. After a while in Lagos, I didn't rent a car. Uh, but I we used both Uber for the most part and luckily at a point in time I got a good driver that used to take us around so I'll call him each time we are going out and it was really really helpful uh, Also a boat driver I also met him on boat and I saw how he was and you know uh, we got along and then they're taking us to uh, a lot of places uh, So that is us when we got to our first destination which is Lekki Conservation Center in Lekki Lagos, Nigeria Hello. So the center opens Monday through Sundays and from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. And then when once we got in, we went to make payments. And then once you make payments, you sit at this waiting area for your group, for your tour guide to come take you. Usually like going uh, in a group. And I can't remember how much we paid, but it was less than 5,000 if I remember correctly. It was quite affordable, I would say, and that that gives you access into the place. There's a playground for kids as well, and this is us on our way to the canopy walkway, which is like the major attraction there. I would say the other things to do, of course, but I think the walkway is like one of the big highlights of the place. However, they don't allow kids below ten uh, to go on the canopy walkway, so Fiza could not go with us. Uh, unfortunately and she really wanted to go but i'm glad she did not go because even me <laughs> i was a bit scared <laughs> uh, so then we set out and uh, this is us you know with the other people in the group uh going to the place uh so there's a deck that you can stay so what what i did was uh so me and nabila went first and then nabil went by himself because he had to stay with fusa since fusa could not go uh, so there was an adult as well like one of the staff there and then uh nabil was uh, there and you know while we left uh for our own session well, okay. be safe okay Bye. see you guys thank you that looks really oh, we'll high. Fine. And this is us getting ready to go on the canopy walkway. Uh, meanwhile, I met this uh, Kenyan lady and her daughter uh, in, in this group. I'm talking about Kenya and the unrest that was going on. Uh, if there was a country I was contemplating to go in, I was Kenya, honestly. But with the unrest and everything, like I'm even with the expensive flight, <laughs> I had to have bought me here. <laughs> so I'm just talking about Kenya and Nairobi with the lady here. 
myself and Nabila got back from our own town and then Nabila went by himself and was taking pictures, taking videos, feeling cool with himself. He also enjoyed it. And then myself and the girls went to the, um, there's a um, kid playground uh, in there. So we went there and then Nabila came to meet us uh, at the family park uh, there. So meanwhile, something unpleasant happened to me at this place. So when we are going in, they told us not to take in any food or anything like that, because the monkeys, they once they sense it, they will come towards you to get it from you. So I took, I forgot I had biscuits in my bag for the kids, and that's how one silly monkey came to. But it didn't attack me, but it was coming close to me. So I, I now ran. I fell. I got bruised, like my lip, my leg, it was not funny at all, like, each time I remember this place, that's <laughs> what I remember, the monkey into this. <laughs> On this day, I asked uh, two of my cousins to meet us up here, uh, because that was the only way I could see people in Nigeria, having to like hook up in places, family and friends, I mean, uncles, aunties, I went home to greet them, but my, like, my cousins, my friends, I'd be like, let's hook up here, let's hook up there, if not, <laughs> I don't want to see anybody. So my cousins, two of them, they are twins. They come to see us at this place. They live in Lekki as well. So it was easy for them to come, you know, hook up with us. And then I saw them after so many years. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, see what's here? Bye, what's here? Bye. Bye. Ah, ah. Bye, what's here? Ah, ah. Bye, da. Ah, ah. Bye, what's here? This is my cousin. I said I used to do a design for us. Ah, ah. But I'm saying this. Take me the day. But that's how you buy me while somebody dig me. Bye. Bye. Uh -uh. Bye. This is my brother. Bonnie. Uh -uh. You worry. Hey, hey. So it was really nice to see my cousins again after so many years. We cut off, we talked, we know, took pictures, and then we are going somewhere else again with the kids. So they drove me, drove us to the place. It was very nice of them. I was in the car, we were talking and just crashing catching up on you know, old times and things like that and then we went to our next adventure come with us Hello. 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 good to see you guys again after <laughs> <don't see you. laughs> thanks for bringing us here good evening, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay. So our next place is called Sarah Senior Hot Hope. It's in Lake Lagos. Uh, it's a beautiful hot space. Uh, I do recommend this place. 
So the first thing we got to do was to do, I don't even know what it's called, where you put your hand in one kind of liquid, you pour something in it, and then it takes the form of your hands. So me and my kids did that together. Uh, while we were doing that, there were a lot of beautiful places. We were just looking around, beautiful space, honestly. You need to, your hand won't show at all. No, 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 no. You need to move your Go hand. down. Go down. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Did everyone show to show. I'm like, I'm going to. 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 where you just go there to view art or to buy art. Here you are making your own art piece with your hands. Just like you just tried out the hand in hand. So you practice different forms of art and this is our country corner where we make use of clay to make masterpieces. So this we all these pieces were actually made here by different people. And these are the potter's wheel. So these machines are called potter's wheel. You okay. sit here, you have a bowl of clay and you mold it into any object of your choice. But you don't go with your art piece immediately because it needs to dry and it has to be baked. We put it in, a, in an oven and then we eat it all and then we come back and pick it up after like four weeks. Mm -hmm. So the husband, the students, and the wife, and the children. So this is like a reminder for uh, the essence to remind uh, people of the, uh, the responsibility of the husband to the wife and the, the, and the parents to their children. And also for the children to also know that you also have a responsibility to the parents. Okay, let's go. So, what do you do in mural painting? Like painting on the wall. This one, you stay in front of it, you take pictures of the wings. I try to take pictures here as well. Okay. Yeah. So, this is the master thing you want to see. You see the the feather, the feather of wood. And this is also for the picture as well. You take picture like you are holding the cake, or you are walking, you are holding the umbrella, or you are walking with the door, or you want to keep the door as well. I feel like that. Yeah. You will look accessible in your shirt. This world is a question. What it is. It is, what? it is what it is. But what is this gumbo set like? What exactly are we talking about when we say it is what it is? Mm. So we also have an in-house cafe where you can order the food on their menu. Okay. Okay. Oh wow! It's a beautiful space. Wow! 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 <laughs> Look at that! Oh my God! Oh my God! Look at that! Wow! 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 And we have okay. this table made out of an actual car. Wow, good so evening. This car is a Mercedes Benz C Class 230 model, popularly called V Wow. So the V was actually gotten from this V shape. Okay. So we cut the, uh, the car into two halves, and this is the back side. Wow. And the seats were also made out of a car. Wow. And there is a ceiling painting of the Calabar dancers, so sculpture from the Calabar carnival. Wow. So this entire space is designed such that you can take pictures anywhere and it will still look nice. nice. Alright. And here we have uh, Mr. V on Agbada. So the concept here is uh, to take a mirror selfie. There is a mirror here. So, you, so this space is, if you like art, it comes with like three red flags. And here we have 
have an illustration of um, Lagos Broad Street in 1914. That's like 110 years ago. Mm -hmm. So this is how the Broad Street used to look like at the time. You can see more wider streets and the vintage cars. No anymore. Yeah. <laughs> and this is our vintage corner where we showcase old stuff. We have the electric arm. We have the, telephone the telephone. Then. We have the typewriter and the vinyl player and this radio. This radio used to be a big deal then. When you have it in your house, you take a picture with it to show off that you have it. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the telephone we had then, you see, we didn't have mobile phones. See? So there was no mobile phones. If you want to pick a call, you have to run to your house. <laughs> okay, we have different spaces for different activities. It's a beautiful space. So. And this is the Owambe Hall. The Owambe okay. is named after the ceiling painter of the Yoruba drummers holding different types of drums. Okay. And the activity we have here is called the art cycle. So you create an art piece while you're cycling. You see it on the bicycle, you have your paint, you have your canvas, and then as you're cycling, you pour paint on the canvas. Because as you're cycling, this thing will spin. Rotate, yeah. And then you pour your paint on the canvas as it is. So this is the superhero team restroom. It has okay. illustrations of superheroes using the restroom. <laughs> you know, I, I always wonder why we call the restroom the restroom actually. Since we don't rest here. But this one you can rest in the restroom. That's why we have the seat there. Seat there. So it is a proper restroom. Interesting. Okay. That's, <laughs> That's funny. Evil all is made the Okay. The Alsa Hall is named after the ceiling painting as well of the Alsa Hall. And all our species are actually little, so you can bring in private events. Oh, okay. Birthdays, tea body. Oh, that's good. And here is another restroom. This is the cat restroom. You can see on the wall the cat. I mean, I would like this. <laughs> You like this because you like it? Yeah, this is the same nice and bum bum. your shop and spin and spill. So here you place an art piece with gun. Place it with, with gun. gun. Okay, the so we are going to eat here. Yeah, we, we inject paint in balloons and then we hang it here and then there will be a canvas on the and then you splash the paint, you shoot the balloon and then the paint will drop on the canvas. Okay. And these are all the spin as well. You splash paint on the canvas as a spinning. And when you do an activity here, you get to write your name on the board. Oh, and, really? also, and also, you paint on this wall. Oh. So the concept here, and I take your picture from that end, it's going to look like you're on the Oh, yeah, it so, does. So you can, you can take a picture like this, like you want to jump, you want to dive in the water. And Okay, future. Yeah, I did it. Okay. <laughs> we're gonna turn so around. Going to turn we're gonna turn upside down. We're gonna turn upside down. Okay. Put it like that. So like this. So my dear children said they wanted to do their own individually as well. Besides the one we did together. So they had their individual session. Uh, the girls wanted to hold the rose. Uh, we said wanted the peace sign. So they did that on their own. And while we were waiting for that to cool off, we also had snacks. We had small chops and drinks. It came with the package we got for this session. It was really delicious. It was hot. It was really nice. I really enjoyed the small chops. <laughs> Be careful, you will be careful. Yeah, because you might cut our painting. And be careful, don't scratch. Don't cut too deep. And don't scratch. That feels so nice. Okay, maybe. What's the thing? What's the thing? What's the thing? Yeah, I did
Because I'm too Guys. Amazing. Amazing. It, was, it, it like showed my two like hidden talent in art. <laughs> yeah, good job. What about you? It was really fun. I liked everything. It was oh, like, your yeah. favorite and thing. Oh, the favorite. Was so fun. Yeah, it was yeah, fun. Yeah, super duper fun. Oh, the favorite. See that? The painting. Yeah. Mine was the hands. Yeah. yeah. I love both of them. Can go, yeah, yeah, I like it. Uh, like yeah. And that was pretty much what our time was at Ferrasenis Arts Hub. We had a wonderful, wonderful time, honestly. We were there till evening. Like, I think it was around 7 p.m. or thereabouts, or even if it's past 7, we left there and we went home. I used to come here a lot. You used to go to a lot of mouse. Statue and I made this painting. What's the painting about? A sunset. A sunset. Okay, let me see. Which was a beach. With a beach. Good. Good job. I like to the other one, my love. Let me make a statue. Your arm. Your arm. Good. Good. So I made a hot air balloon, but
Now I'll just my hand. My held a flower. So pretty. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> this is my own artwork. I made I printed a, a this is a woman, then I colored her. And this is four of us, myself, Nabil, Nabil and Fuser are beautiful ants come together. And the essence of this is just showing them like, like I mean like a powerhouse for them. And they have they are they are around their powerhouse, so they have my my hand is there in the middle and then my kids are surrounding my aunt and like that, like that. So that's the essence of this one. Look at how pretty our artworks are, and it's so beautiful that we made this ourselves. That's why it even makes them more special. Like each time we look at this, we just admire it. We captured this uh, on the um, uh, on the TV sets we got in Nigeria, the house we got. So we kept them there for like for like a decor. It was always so pleasant to see every morning when we woke up they was there for the most part till we left nigeria and almost every morning we all always admire this art Shelly feels like he'll come and admire it and say stupid things <laughs> about them and we are wondering if you have to bring it to canada you're like ah oh, how will you carry it and to the glory of god these pieces made to canada but the and in hand craft and the artwork all of them Go to Canada with us. <laughs> so happy about that. See how beautiful it is. Anyway, I've come to the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching. Please do what to subscribe, comment, like, share, and do all those good stuff. I'll see you in my next video by God's grace. Bye and take care.